Henry the Green Engine Gets Out, written by the Reverend W. Audrey and narrated by me, Daniel Solano. Henry the Green Engine hated rain. One wet day, he went into a tunnel and stopped. Go on, said his driver. No, said Henry. The rain will spoil my green paint and red stripes. The guard blew his whistle and waved his green flag, but still Henry stayed in the tunnel. So, they decided to leave Henry where he was. They took up the old rails, built a wall to shut him in, and cut a new tunnel beside the old one. Two other engines, Edward and Gordon, often went through this new tunnel. Edward would say, Peep, peep, hello. And Gordon would say, Poop, 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 serves you right. Gordon always pulled the express. Hurry, 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 he panted. I'll soon reach the tunnel and poop, poop, poop at Henry. But there was a whoosh of steam. His driver stopped the train. You burst your safety valve, he said. The guard went for another engine. Edward was the only one he could find. Edward's no use. He can't pull the train, said Gordon rudely. He was right. Edward puffed and puffed, but he couldn't move the heavy coaches. Why don't you let Henry try, said Gordon. Gordon's driver and fireman lit Henry's fire. Some plate layers broke down the wall and relayed the rails. Henry puffed stiffly out and went to find a turntable. He came back chimney first. They put him in front. Peep, peep, whistled Edward. I'm ready. Peep, 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 whistled Henry. So am I. The heavy coaches jerked and began to move. They never stopped till they reached the big station. The passengers all said thank you, and the fat controller promised Henry a new coat of paint. Henry doesn't mind the rain anymore. His driver always rubs him down carefully when the day's work is over.